great project like this needs great planning. And we've been working on it now for about uh, 10 years. What's been fascinating for me has been working with one of the world's greatest architects, Norman Foster, on what in effect is an almost complete transformation of the museum. The wing itself is bigger than many a medium-sized American museum, and this is arguably the largest project being undertaken for American art and culture in America at this time. The wing is, of course, full of surprises. There are a number of recent acquisitions on view and some exciting loans, but what fascinates me is the number of treasures that have come out of store individual paintings, works of sculpture, and also, in some cases, whole period rooms. The galleries are arranged chronologically. It's very simple, basically, starting at the earliest period with pre-Columbian art and coming up to the late 20th century on the top floor of the museum. I'm particularly passionate about sculpture, and sculpture is often neglected by the public when they visit a museum, you know, the painting is king in a kind of way. Well, in a gallery like this, you see the three-dimensional objects talking with the two-dimensional, and suddenly the sculpture seems at home. One of the magical things about the museum is you can come here and meet some of the great figures of American history. What I'm particularly fascinated by is making a new social space within the museum. That space is the Shapiro family courtyard. It's a gorgeous glass space surrounded by gardens. There we'll have the new American cafe, but it's a place to relax, to meet friends, perhaps organize a party in the evening, or perhaps even having a wedding here one day. It's an exciting space, a new sort of uh, forum for Boston. I'm so proud to be working in one of America's most historic cities and to be doing something new here, to be adding to the richness and variety of the great cultural center of Boston. If I have one emotion at the moment, it's pride in what we've achieved. At the heart of everything we're doing is an improved visitor experience. Welcome to the Museum of Fine Arts.